Hi, I'm Rachel Carroll, Manager of Operations and Co-Founder of the Carroll Home Team. Today, I wanna to talk to you about what you need to know about living in Vero Beach, Florida. What is life like for the locals? Why would somebody want to move here? Stay tuned because I'm gonna take you on a little journey through this great town that I love and that my family calls home. Let's go. In this video, I'm gonna cover a few different talking points like home price, cost of living, lifestyles, community, weather, and more. So if you like this video, be sure to click subscribe, click the bell so that you'll get notified every time one of my new videos drops. If you would like a copy of our free buyer's guide, home buyer's guide, or our new free locals guide with all the great information about our very favorite places to eat, shop, etc., and our favorite local vendors, please let me know. I will be happy to send that to you. Leave a comment for me below. All right, so I like to be bright and I like to be brief, so that's how we're gonna keep this video. First things first, I wanna describe Vero Beach for you. So Vero Beach, in my opinion, is a beautiful coastal town very sophisticated as well and it's really kind of where blue collar can coexist with billionaires it's a really interesting mix and there's a lot of really wonderful things that come out of that a lot of different activities and uh, lifestyle sports and access to a lot of different things and resources so Vero Beach has all kinds of different activities to fit anybody's interest um, just to name a few, we've got a world-class art museum, we've got sophisticated street shopping, walkable restaurants and bistros, we've got an outlet mall, <laughs> we have some really nice uh, great bre breweries that are some family friendly, some a little less, but some really nice options for craft brew beers. Um, we've got a lot of great local events that happen on a monthly basis, like community-wide events. There are some great options for nature excursions, um, water sports. We've got lovely wildlife preserves that are open to the public. Um, honestly, some of the best beaches on the Atlantic coast. I know I'm biased, but they are breathtakingly beautiful and they're not crowded and also publicly accessible. There are no shortage of golf course options and we have a lot of great lifestyle sports that you can participate in all throughout the year. The last little thing I wanted to mention as well is we've got some world-class resorts a very high end um, and some really lovely spas. The resorts have great restaurant options as well that you can take advantage of as a local if you wanna do something a little bit fancy. Let's switch gears for a moment from all of the things that are here for you to do in Vero Beach and let's talk a little bit about how much it costs. So just briefly, I wanna to touch on the average home price here in Vero Beach as a real estate agent myself here locally, that is something that is very important um, that I think the general public should know. How much does it cost to live here? So an average number for a house, home price here in Vero Beach is around $290,000. That's for a single family home. And Vero Beach really offers a very wide range of options when it comes to different types of places you can live in in different communities. So obviously we have condominiums, we've got townhouses, we've got our single family homes. We have traditional neighborhoods um, without homeowners associations. And we have some really lovely options that do have homeowners associations, community, uh, gated communities, communities with clubhouses. It really depends on the lifestyle that you're looking for and the type of amenities and, and living space that you want to have. It is really important to note that the housing expenses, the average general housing expenses here in Vero Beach is a, 
about 19 to 20% lower than the national average. And as somebody who's lived in multiple different parts of our country myself, I can tell you that Vero Beach is a very affordable place to live. One of my favorite things to do here when I am able to is to catch the sunrise and the sunset. So the sun rises here over the ocean around 6.30 to 7 a.m. in the morning and the sun sets over the river, which is right behind me, around the same time but in the p.m. So 6.30 to 7 o'clock p.m. depending on the time of year. But what's so cool is just from this one city, this one location, you can see both the sun rising over the water and the sun setting over the water. And I'm telling you, it's breathtaking. It is something really to behold. Sometimes it's yellowy with an orange glow. Sometimes it's like the most beautiful shades of purple and pink. It's really nice. It's definitely something that I recommend doing whether you're visiting or you live here. Catch the sunset and the uh, sunrise and the sunset. One of the things that I mentioned in my introduction was the weather and I do want to touch base on that. So here in Vero Beach, we are right at the cusp where the tropics, the Florida tropics begin. Everything from Vero Beach below is considered the tropics of Florida. So we do get tropical weather. Um, unlike other parts of the country, we don't really have four dis distinct seasons like uh, winter, spring, summer, fall. It's more so broken up into two different seasons. So what we call here locally, in season and out of season. So what in season is going to look like is pretty much your fall and winter um, season that starts around the end of October and runs you through about the end of April. And the weather here during the season is, I would say, some of the best weather in the entire country all year round. It is so nice. Um, we it's hovers around the low 70s with a very light breeze and at nighttime it can get into like the mid 50s so cool but not cold it's really lovely and almost every day is sunny without rain so our out of season months are going to run from about may through october this is uh the time when our temperatures are the warmest peaking around the very low 90s and dipping at night to uh you know mid 70s so it is warm or you could even call it hot during the day and a little tepid at night a lot of times when we're talking about our out of season what we'll see is a population dip pretty significantly because our um, secondary homeowners will actually leave the area and they will go spend their summers elsewhere and when our season comes back on in the fall they come back into our area to enjoy some of the best weather in the entire country all in all i think Vero beach is such a wonderful place to live. I could live anywhere and I choose to live here. It's such a cool city. Um, it's really kind of sophisticated, but also laid back at the same time with a very artistic flair, believe it or not. I really just love it. So what do you think? Could you see yourself living here in Vero Beach? Let me know your thoughts, comments. If I missed anything in your local here and you want to add to it, please, you're welcome to add to the comment section below. I feel like the more we share about this really wonderful place that we live, the more other people can come to love it, um, be inclined to come visit and see for themselves how great this area is. I'm sure I did not cover everything in this one quick video. Um, so again, please feel free to share. Sharing is caring. Uh, if you found this video helpful, intriguing, whatever, and you like the content, again, please hit the subscribe button, give it a like, um, hit the little bell notifications so that you can get more content like this from our channel. And if you want, again, that free buyer's guide or that local's guide, leave me a comment below. I'll get the notification. I'll be happy to send it your way. I'm Rachel Carroll with the Carroll Home Team, um, your team here in the Treasure Coast. And lastly, I'd be remiss if I didn't say this as a local real estate agent, 
If you want to know more about homes in our area or what is the process to kind of push the ball forward and consider moving here, a member of my team would be more than happy to speak with you. We would love to be your local resource here. The number you can reach us at is 772-494-5422. Also, you can check out our website at www.letsellflorida.com. You can see everything that's for sale in our area um, and let us know how we can be of service. Thanks so much.